Thank you for visiting my YouTube channel to get your daily Bible verse and Bible chapter. I hope you have a great day and come back each and every day for a new verse and a new chapter. Thank you and God bless. First Kings 4, Solomon's government. So King Solomon was the king of Israel. These were his important officers. Ziah, king of Zedek, was the priest. Eli, king of Elias. Eli and Elijah were the, king, were the sons of Shisha. They wrote down what happened. Jehoshaphat, son of Alud, Joseph had looked after what? Was written. Ben, son of Judea, Ben was the leader of the army. Zadok and Ab were priests. Azariah, son of Nathan, he told 12 officers what to do. Zabu, son of Nathan, Zabu was the priest, and he was a friend of the king. Azar kept the king's houses. Ad, the son of of Abbot. Ad told the workers what they should do. Solomon had 12 officers. They were in different places in Israel. They supplied food for the king and for his people that lived in his houses. Each officer had to supply food for for one month in each year. These are the names. Ben Hur, he supplied the food from the hills of Ephraim. Ben Decker, he supplied the food from Menek. To Shebram and from Beth Shebish to El Beth Hanan. Ben Hees supplied the food from Arubeth, Sokoth, and all the fields around Hepper, where he is. Ben Ab, he supplied the food from the hills near, near Doa. He had married Solomon's daughter called Tabith. Bana, son of Alilud, he supplied the food from Tanak. Them, Megdu, and all of Bethshan. Bethshan is near Zarnath. which is below Jezreel. He supplied the food from Bethshan to a pill. To Jokoman. Ben Garber, he supplied the food from Ramoth Gilead, the village of 
Manic son, Jair, and Gilead were his. Also, the, the country around Aruba, Bashan were his. It included 60 large cities. The cities had walls and long pieces of metal to lock, lock the gates. Arubadab, son of Ida, I do. He supplied food from Manium Ahamenez. He supplied food from Nap Napili. Ahmez had married. Bad mess, Solomon's daughter. Banana, the son of Hushi, he supplied food from Asher and Aloth. Jehoshaphat, son of Pira, he supplied food from Ishnakar. Shema, he supplied from food from Benjamin. Gerber. He supplied food from Gilead. Gilead was the country where Shahan was king. He was king of the people. Called Ammonites. He also... It also was a country country where Og was the king of Bashan. Gerber was only was the only officer in the country. Solomon's kingdom. There were many people in Judah and Israel. There were as many of them as the bits of sand by the sea. They ate and they drank, so they were very happy. And Solomon ruled over the king, all the kingdom. The kingdom was from the river Euphrates to the country where the Philistines lived. They lived near the border of, of Egypt. The people from these places brought gifts to Solomon, and they were his servants all the days of his life. And this is what his officers supplied Solomon each day. Thirty cores of flour, sixty cores of wheat, ten cows, eight in the farm buildings, twenty cows, eight in the fields, a hundred sheep. <clears throat> also, animals called deer, gazelle roebuck, and chickens. Solomon ruled all the land west of River Euphrates. 
he ruled from Tip to Gaza. There was no war in any of these places. <clears throat> While Solomon ruled, Judah and Israel were safe. Each person lived under their vine of victory from Dan to Beersheba. Solomon had 4,000 buildings for horses that pulled chariots, and he had 12,000 ho horses. The 12 officers supplied food for the king. For King Solomon. For. And for everyone. That ate with him. The king got. Everything. That he needed. Each officer brought. His part. They brought food. And dry grass. For the horses. That pulled chariots. And for the other horses. Solomon's wisdom. God gave Solomon wisdom. He could see that things mean so he could understand them well. He had more wisdom than there are bits of sand on the seashore. Solomon had more wisdom than all the men in the east. His wisdom was greater than all the wisdom in Egypt. He had more wisdom than any other man. This includes the man they called Ethan and the Azaleite and includes Haman. Calcoil and Darba. Calcoil and Darba were the sons of Methal. Solomon was famous in all the countries around Israel. He spoke 3,000 proverbs and spoke and wrote 5,000 songs. And he described many places. He described large ones like the cedar trees that grow in Lebanon. And he described small ones like the small plants called hyssop that grows on walls. And he taught people about all kinds of animals, birds, fish, and things that move on there. Stomachs. People came from all countries to listen to the wisdom of Solomon. Every king on earth who had heard about his wisdom sent someone. Matthew 22. 37. Jesus replied, Love the Lord God with all your heart and with all your soul and with all your mind. Again, Matthew twenty-two thirty-seven. 37. Jesus replied, Love the Lord your God with all your heart 
with all your soul, and with all your mind. One of my favorite verses is Philippians 4.13. And it says, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. If you have your own favorite verse, please put that down below and let me know what it is. Again, today's verse of the, of the day is Matthew 22.37. Jesus replied, Love the Lord your God with all your heart, your soul, and with all your mind. Always remember to smile because you never know what a smile can do for someone's day. Thank you for watching today's video. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe so you can remember to watch each and every day's video. Thank you for the ones that have been with me from the beginning. Please help me expand my ministry. Thank you and God bless.